Glory be to God in the higher Amen. For his mercy and your forever. Amen. Hallelujah. For his mercy and your forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. In the higher, amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, in the higher, amen, hallelujah, for his mercies and your forever, amen, hallelujah, for his mercy and your forever. Never, amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, ah, in the ah, yeah. amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, ah, in the ah, yeah. amen, hallelujah, for his mercies and your rare forever, forever, amen. Oh, is mercy and your forever, amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, in the yeah. amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, in the yeah. amen, hallelujah, for his mercies and your forever amen hallelujah for his mercies and your forever amen he can never never fail oh yeah he can never never fail he can never never fail jesus jesus Forever, hallelujah, he can never, never fail, he can never fail, he can never, never fail, he can never fail, he can never, never fail, ah, Jesus, he say, forever, our Father, oh, our Father, oh, I did never, oh, Amen. Oh, I love your name. Oh, our Father, Lord, our Father, oh, oh I did never. Amen. I love your name. Oh, I love your name. Oh, Hallelujah, be your name. Hallelujah, your name. Hallelujah, be your name. Let's go ahead and begin to worship the Lord. Let's lift up our voices. Let's begin to adore Him. Let's begin to exalt His holy name. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be adored. Worthy to be exalted. Worthy to be lifted on high. There is no one like Him. There was none like Him. There has never been anyone like Him. He is the most high. Let's worship our Father. Let's worship our God. Let's worship our King. Let's worship our Savior. He is the all in all. He is the one that was, the one that is the one that is yet to come, the Almighty Himself. Father, I worship you. Jesus, I magnify your name. Ancient of days, I bless your name. Eternal Redeemer, I give you praise. I give you glory. I give you honor. I give you adoration. Who is it like thee? Who can compare to thee? Father, there is none of God. You are higher than the highest. You are better than the best. Bigger than the biggest. You are the most high. The Almighty Himself. The one that speaketh and it is done. You are the God 
Lord that command and is established. You are the all powerful. You are God. You are bigger, oh God, than all our expectations. You are more than our knowing. Father, we worship you tonight, ancient of days. We exalt your name. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor, Lord. We give you adoration, Lord. Blessed, blessed, blessed be your name, mighty Father. Blessed, blessed be your name, mighty Savior. Blessed, blessed be your name, mighty Redeemer, the only one of Israel. I am that I am. The beginning and the end. Oh, the Alpha. You are the Omega, oh Lord. You are the God in your, you are the God in yesterday. You are the God in today. You are the God in tomorrow. The Almighty, ever present, ever powerful. Oh God, we worship you, Lord. We exalt your name. We magnify your name. Blessed be your name, oh Lord. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. You want to lift up your voice. You want to thank him now, specifically for answers to all your prayer this year already. Now this is the seven of these seven days of praying, even unto the, unto him concerning this new year. You want to thank him for answer, assurance that he answered you the first day, the second day, the third day, the fourth day, fifth day, sixth day, even today, the seventh day. You are sure he's going to answer you. I want to just lift up your voice as a father. Thank you for answers to my prayer already for this new year. Thank you, O God, because surely I know you have answered me. Thank you, O God, because surely I know you are answering me. Thank you. Oh God, because surely I know you will answer me further. Let's go ahead and begin to thank him. Father, I come before you. Lord, I am not taking it for granted. For the grace, oh God, to wait upon thee in place of prayer, even from day one, even to now. Thank you for assurance that you answer my prayer. Thank you for every answer to my prayer. Thank you for every answer to my petition. Thank you for attending, oh God, to my cry. Thank you for attending, oh God, oh God, to my voice. Thank you you, oh God, for the miracle that I've started already. Thank you for the glorious manifestation that I've started already. Thank you for the blessing. Thank you for the preservation. Thank you for the provision. Thank you for fighting already in my battle. Thank you for the glories that lies ahead. Thank you for the blessing, the breakthrough, oh God. Thank you for a secure year for me. Lord, I am grateful, oh Lord. Thank you, oh God, for my home. Thank you for my wife. Thank you for my children. Thank you for my brethren. Thank Thank you, O God, for assurance of safety in all my journey. Lord, I am grateful because you have answered me. Thank you, the God that have answered my prayer. Thank you, the God that have answered me. Thank you, the God that have answered me. Lord, I return to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for restoring my health. Thank you for making me healthy, for keeping the way sicknesses and disease far away from me, far away from my home, far away from my wife, far away from my children. Thank you for restoring the health of my wife. Thank you, oh God, for your healing. Thank you for restoring the health of my children. Thank you for the healing. Thank you for your glory upon my life, upon my home. Father, I am grateful, Lord. Jesus, I am grateful, Lord. Savior, I am grateful, Lord. Thank you for attending to my prayers, Lord. Thank you, oh Lord, for attending to my prayers, Lord. Lord, I am grateful, oh Lord. Thank you for this glorious year. Thank you, oh God, for this beautiful year. Thank you for your wind that is blowing already in my favor. Lord, I am grateful, Lord. Blessed, 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 blessed be your name, O Lord. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, eternal Redeemer. Blessed be your name, O Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Amen. You want to lift up your voice? You want to ask God for mercy? Is there any way you have, eh? Is there any sin, oh, that will be an interest against your life this year? You want to cry to him, let him have mercy, and let him forgive you of all your sin. Are you ready to pray somebody? Go ahead and begin to cry to him for mercy. Cry for forgiveness of your sin. Cry to him to purge you, to purge your life, even in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, my God, King of glory, ancient of days, I come unto you, O God, today. I cry, O, oh, for your mercy, O Lord, in any way that I might have heard against thee, in any way that I might have sinned against thee. Father, please have mercy and for Forgive me. Ancient of day, have mercy and forgive me. Eternal Redeemer, have mercy and forgive me. Forgive me of every sin. Forgive me of every unrighteousness. Forgive me of every iniquity. Forgive me of every filthiness. Forgive me of every disobedience. Father, every known and unknown sin in my life. Father, please have mercy and forgive me. Father, please have mercy and forgive me.
forgive me. Father, please have mercy and forgive me. Father, please have mercy and forgive me. Father, please have mercy and forgive me. Ancient of days, have mercy and forgive me. Father, have mercy and forgive me. Father, have mercy and forgive me. Forgive me, oh my Father. Forgive me, oh my King. Even in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. You want to pray tonight, and I want you to make up your mind to pray. Amen. Remember, God is still in our yesterday, as much as is in our today, and is already in our tomorrow. So, He can work whatever error that is in our yesterday that is still affecting our to, that is affecting our today, or that can affect our tomorrow. So that's why somebody wants to pray. You want to command every error in the past that is now affecting your health. Was there something wrong in the past in your yesterday? Was there any error in your yesterday that is not affecting your health today? Let God that is still in your yesterday, let him reverse it so that your health can be made perfect now, even in the name of Jesus Christ. Are you ready to pray somebody? Say every error in my yesterday. Now remember I said your yesterday, somebody your yesterday could actually be literal yesterday or could be last month, could be last year, could be two years ago. I mean, whatever is your past is your yesterday. Amen. So say with all your heart, say every error in my yesterday that is now affecting my health. Oh God, that is still in my yesterday. Please reverse that error now in the name of Jesus Christ. Lift up your voice and begin to pray that prayer. Every error in my yesterday, every mistake in my yesterday that is now affecting my health today. God, that is still in my yesterday. Please reverse that error now in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, that is still in my yesterday. Please reverse the error now. 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 The error in my yesterday that is affecting my hair. The mistake in my yesterday that is now affecting my hair. Oh God that is still in my yesterday. Please reverse the error now. Reverse it 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 now. God that is still in my yesterday whatever error in my yesterday that is affecting my health today, whatever error in my yesterday that is affecting my, oh, my health today, God that is still in my yesterday, reverse it, now, reverse it, now, reverse it, reverse the error, reverse the error, reverse the error in the name of Jesus Christ, every foundational error, every foundational mistake that is now affecting my health. God that is still in my yesterday, you are still there at that point of that error. You are still there at that point of that mistake. My Father, my God, that is still in my yesterday, reverse the error now. Reverse the error now. Reverse the error now. Reverse that mistake. Reverse that error. Reverse the mistake. Reverse that error. Reverse that mistake now. Male Koso pale do shoto brade le kosa talianda embre de le jubarada sete le kalabosha reverse it now in the name of Jesus Christ lende setere androlo shahali bali handaria thank you faithful Father in Jesus mighty name we pray amen you want to command any power that is postponing your day of joy let that power lose its hold over your joy let that power lose its hold over your life whatever power that is causing delay to the arrival of your day of joy let the power lose its hold let your joy let it be now let this 2024 let your joy manifest because it's your year of glorious manifestation in the name of jesus christ Say any power. Can you say with boldness? Say any power postponing the day of postponing my day of joy 
I command, lose your hold over my life now. Perish by fire. Say any power postponing the day of my joy, any power delaying the day of my joy, lose your hold over my life now. Die right away by fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, open your mouth and pray that prayer. Whatever power that is postponing, whatever power that is not, oh, that is saying, no, your joy will not be now. Let that power lose its hold over your life. Is it a covenant? Is it a cause? Is it a foundational power? Is it the power of your father's house? Whatever power it is that is saying no to your joy today, don't be gentle with that power. Don't allow that power. Command that power. Let it lose its hold. It's not your God. It's not your God. So let it lose its hold over your life. Power delaying the day of my joy. I command in the name of Jesus Christ. Lose your hold over my life now. Die by fire. In the name of Jesus Christ. Power Power postponing the day of my joy. I say, ah, why are you still alive? Lose your hold over my life. Die uh -huh. by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Die now by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Die now by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Die now by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Mando sutele brudush kalado shete produce teleanda. Power. I will postpone the day of my joy. Lose your hold over my life. Die now by fire. Power delay the day of my joy. Lose your hold over my life. Die now by fire. Power postpone the day of my joy. Lose your hold over my life. Die now by fire. Randa soto pranilianda. Legu jekere bojo. Imbrodo jakali kuria. Randa kurianda. Le kurianda. Le gegegegege. Power delay my joy. Lose your own now. Da aha. In the name of Jesus Christ. Power delay my joy. Lose your own now. Da aha. In the name of Jesus Christ. Power postpone the day of my joy. Lose your own now. Da. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lose your own now. Da. Lose your own now. Da. Lose your own now. Da. Lentru satali handrali malikus kadi brodo shoto brada liskala him brodo zutoni ende kashe tele brodo sa. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Father, we thank you because you are the Most High. Thank you for assurance of answers to our prayers. Thank you for the one of this program, even the two, the three, the four, the five, the six, now the seven. Father, we thank you for taking us on this journey. Thank you for answers to all the prayer we have prayed. Thank you for assurance that you answer all every other prayer we are still going to pray. Father, we say, blessed be your name in the name of Jesus Christ. As we go briefly into your word, we pray you speak to us. By your word, deliver to us year of glorious, a uh, year of glorious manifestation in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. God bless you. Congratulations. If you have been with us since day one of this program, I can assure you surely as God of heaven lives before whom I stand, this year shall be unto you indeed your year of glorious manifestations. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every prayer you have prayed already from the one, the two, three, four, five, six, and even today, you can be sure that the answer will come by fire. The answer comes speedily in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, we want to continue. Now, uh, the, the, our anchor test for this seven days prayer it has been Exodus chapter 3, verse 14. Exodus chapter 3, verse 14. Amen. When you read from verse uh, 13, amen. I mean, there was an encounter between Moses and God. God gave him an assignment. And to Moses, no, this was a suicider, a place that he ran away from. A place that, he became, I mean, he ran away. I mean, it was because, you know, uh, somebody accused him, you know, that he killed an Egyptian, you know, and then uh, his true identity has now been revealed that he was not a true Egyptian. He was an Hebrew boy. Amen. And so he knew that, hey, if Pharaoh hears that, the end, that's so he ran far away from there. And 
God is now sending him back to that land. And now not just to that land, to the same Pharaoh. <laughs> so it's like uh, uh, the chicken has come home to roast. Amen. I said, God, God, why will you send me on a search and assignment? So he was giving God different excuses why it should not be him that should go. Amen. But eventually, he asked God, okay, God, you have been saying this. I asked this, you answered it. Yeah, okay, now, when I go there, they will ask me, who is there? Who is that God that sent you? What is his name? And I know names give descriptions about who, uh, I mean, who a fellow is. Amen. And God looked left, looked right. God said, well, go and tell them, I am, I've sent you. Amen. In verse 14 of that, Genesis, of that Exodus chapter 3, you know, if you look at that word in New Living Translation, you know, it, it reads, God replied, I am the one who always is. That is, is the God that is always is. Is in yesterday, is in today, is in tomorrow. Amen. He said, Tell them, I am, I've sent you. That is, I am the one that is always is. Amen. Is the God that has no yesterday. Amen. Is already in our, is still in our yesterday as much as is in our today. And it will always, as you know, and it's already present even in our tomorrow. Amen. And Hebrew chapter 13, verse 8, even confirm that. He said, Jesus Christ, the same yesterday, today, and forever. That is, Jesus Christ is still in yesterday, is still in today, is already in tomorrow. Amen. Is the God that always is. Amen. Revelation chapter 1, verse 8 tells us that is the beginning and is the ending. Amen. I mean, it, it, at the same time, is the beginning. I mean, you know. One has to, uh, 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 how can somebody be the beginning and the ending? Amen. But is, 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 that is who he is. Amen. Is the beginning. Okay. You want to ask who is now there the ending? He's, he's still the one. Amen. So is the beginning and ending to all things. Amen. Is always is. Is always is. Is always is. Amen. Is still in yesterday as much as is in today and is also in tomorrow. Revelation 21 verse 6 also confirmed that. Is the alpha is the omega. Amen. Is the first and is the last. Amen. Now, how can somebody be the first and the last? Maybe we have a class, you know, and there's an exam. It's okay. Who is the first person in this class? Who is the first person in the examination? Say, oh, it's Mr. A. Okay. Who is the second person? Mr. A. No, I mean, it, it, it does not sound. It does not sound nice. Amen. It does not sound possible. You can't. You can't score zero and score hundred percent. But God say is the beginning, is the ending, is the first, and is what is the last. Amen. The Revelation twenty two verse thirteen also tells us that that is the first and is also the last. In Isaiah chapter forty four verse six, God Himself says, "See, I am the beginning and I am the end. I am the first and I am what." I am the last. Amen. So God, you know, our first, our last is in him. Our beginning, our ending is what? Is in him. So it means that our yesterday is in him. Our today is in him. Our tomorrow is in him. So which means that what is in our yesterday as much as is in our today, as much as is in our tomorrow. We say with him there is no yesterday. Amen. But our yesterday is what? Is in him. We, you know, we, 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 we have all our being in him. Amen. Act of the Apostle chapter 17 verse 28. Act of the Apostle chapter 17 verse 28. It says, for in him we live. Amen. It is in him that we live and, and then what? And move. It is in him. Amen. We live and we move in him. We move from our yesterday to today is in him. Amen. So it means that it's still in yesterday. We are the one that moved from yesterday to today. It is in him. Amen. So you can imagine moving. Let's say this is your yesterday and you are moving towards your today and you are already your today. Amen. It is in him. Amen. He is still in your yesterday. He is still in your past. He has not left your past. He has not left my past. He said it is in him we live. It is in him we move. It is in him we have our being, our existence. Your existence comprises of what? Of your yesterday. Your your today and your tomorrow. Amen. Your conference of your of your beginning and what and your ending. Amen. So your today, your tomorrow, your to, your yesterday, today and tomorrow is what is in him. That's what that act is out of the post chapter uh, 17 verse uh, uh, 28 say. For in him we live, what we move and have our being. Amen. Have our being. So friends, what it means is that what? God is still very much in your yesterday. As much as it's in today and it will be tomorrow. Now, 
which means that what we can take advantage of the fact that he has not left our yesterday. If there is anything that we miss in our yesterday, we can ask him to bring it into our today. If there's any error, if there's any mistake in our yesterday that is affecting or can affect our today, because it's still there, we can always call on him. Please, can you make this amen for me? Amen. Now, it, it, it's just like you, I mean, I, I, I gave a description. You left your house, for example. Maybe Maybe you left your house for your office. You are ready in your office. Amen. And let us assume that, I mean, uh, 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 you're already settled down in your office. And then you now suddenly remember that the gas, oh, you left the, you know, your gas cooker, you left it on. Amen. Now, at that moment, maybe the time you even remember, maybe you as I mean, you expect that, ah, the damage will have started. Amen. Ah, something will have started going on. So it means that there is nothing you can do at that moment to be back at your home. Amen. If you want to, I mean, there is nothing you can do. Amen. But, I mean, so you had to accept the loss, accept the damage, and probably begin to prepare for it. But if suddenly you remember, you let some Somebody at home. You can, and that person is still at home. You can make a call to that fellow. Hello, my friend. Are you still at home? He said, Yes, I am still at home. The home that you have left. Amen. Now, there was an error you committed. You can ask him, please enter my kitchen and please help me put off the gas cooker. Amen. And he'll put it off. Amen. And then there won't be any loss that will have manifested that moment for you. Oh, the damage that ought to manifest that moment for you, there won't be. Why? Because there is still somebody where you have left. Amen. There is still somebody that was able to correct the error Oh, that you made where you left. Amen. So therefore, no consequence at the present. Amen. Now that is the great things about our God. He is still in our yesterday. We can't go back to that yesterday. So if there's anything that can affect our today, we can call on it because it's still there. Please help me, Lord, put off the gas cooker. Help me, Lord, put off that fire that I mistakenly set up. Help, you know, you can ask him to bring along what you left behind. So friends, there is no reason not to have the best of year this year. Amen. If there's something in your past that is meant to mess up your present year, there is a God that is still in your past that can make amend. If there is something lacking in your present because you did not come along with it from your past, there is still God that is in your past that can bring it along into your present. If there is something that is only made, that is only ahead, that is making a mess of your present, there is a God that is ahead of you already that can what? That can always bring it back. So tonight, with the concluding part of this program, amen, I want you to pray this prayers that I'm suggesting to you with all your heart and surely this year is your year is my year of glorious manifestation and there shall be performance by fire in the name of Jesus Christ the first prayer you want to pray you want to cry to God that is still in your yesterday that whatever he has to do in your yesterday that will guarantee your well-being your prosperity today and always let him go ahead and do maybe there is something that oh if only it was done in your yesterday. Your prosperity, your well-being will have been guaranteed today. But because it was not done, maybe that is why the well-being, the, the prosperity is not been there. Hey, there is a God that is still there. Let him go ahead and do it in the name of Jesus Christ. Are you ready to pray? Say, oh God that is still in my yesterday. Can you please call it with all your heart? Say, oh God that is still in my yesterday. Whatever you have to do in my yesterday that will guarantee my well-being today and always. Whatever you have to do in my yesterday that will guarantee my prosperity today and always, please Lord, go ahead and begin to do in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Open your mouth and pray. He's still in your yesterday to effect changes that will guarantee your well-being.
been a lie. Oh God, that is still in my yesterday. Oh God, that is still in my yesterday. Whatever that you have to do in my yesterday, whatever you have to do in my yesterday, whatever you have to perform in my yesterday, that will guarantee my well-being today and always. Father, please go ahead and do. Oh Lord, 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 go ahead and do. It is in you that I live. It is in you that I move. My yesterday is still in you. You are still very much in my yesterday. You are still very much in my yesterday. Whatever Lord you have to do, whatever law you have to do, whatever correction you have to make in my yesterday, whatever changes you have to make in my yesterday that will guarantee my well-being today and always, that will guarantee my prosperity today and always. Oh God that is still in my yesterday, please go ahead and do, 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 do for me now, whatever you have to do in my yesterday that will guarantee my well-being today and always, do now in the name of Jesus Christ, go ahead and do, O Lord, go ahead and do, O Lord, go ahead and do, O Lord, go ahead and do it, O Lord, male kuskata prodo shete blalilus kalaba rodo satarianda, embrodo lolo jagada karabo sokuria, rekelebo zuri ende likus kadeli andra lishoturi anda. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. The second prayer, the prayer, the next prayer you want to pray, you want to cry to God. Remember, it's as much in your yesterday as it is today. So whatever he has to do in your today, hey, to guarantee your well-being today and always, let him do it. Oh, maybe what he needs to do is still in today. Maybe he has nothing to do with your yesterday. Let him go ahead and do it. He is already in your today. So let him go ahead and do in the name of Jesus Christ. Say, oh God, that is in my today. <laughs> Can you call it with all your heart? Oh God, that is in my today. Whatever you have to do in my today to guarantee my well-being today and always, to guarantee my prosperity today and always, please go ahead and do in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Open your mouth and pray. He knows what to do. He knows what to do. He knows what to do to guarantee your well being to guarantee your prosperity today and always in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh God that is still in my today. Oh God that is still in my today. Oh God that is still in my today. Whatever you have to do in my today that will guarantee my well being now and always. That will guarantee my prosperity now and always. Lord go ahead and do. Oh Lord go ahead and do. Oh Lord go ahead and do. Oh Lord, go ahead and do. Oh, yeah, do in the name of Jesus Christ. Do for me, O Lord, whatever you must do in my today that will ensure my well-being now and always. Whatever you have to do in my today that will ensure my prosperity now and always. Go ahead. Do. Go ahead. Do. Go ahead and do. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and do. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and do. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and do in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever you have to do in my today, Lord, Mama Zuranda Liala, Irodosu Aragada, Eleliala Bushe, Eri Endro Lugadaba, that will guarantee my well being today and always. Irundu Kazagaye, Elia Bujaga, whatever you have to do, Lord, that will ensure my prosperity today and always. Irinda Gadaga, Lord, do it today. Lord, do it now. Lord, do it now. Lord, do it now. You are already in my today. Oh, yeah, do it, Lord. 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 Makasata lebo sheke lebro do satali handa. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' 
mighty day we pray amen oh now the, the the next prayer you want to pray remember is already in your tomorrow amen is there anything he has to do in your tomorrow that will guarantee your well-being today and tomorrow is there anything he has to do in your tomorrow that will ensure your smooth passage into tomorrow in, in wellness and in prosperity let him go ahead and do in the name of jesus right you don't want to enter into tomorrow and struggle you don't want to enter into tomorrow and be diminished, whatever that he needs to do in your tomorrow that will guarantee your well-being and your prosperity is already in your tomorrow. Let him go ahead and do in the name of Jesus Christ. Say, oh God, that is already in my tomorrow. Can you please call him with all your heart? Say, oh God, that is already in my tomorrow. All that you have to do in my tomorrow to guarantee my well-being now and always, all that you have to do in my tomorrow to guarantee my prosperity now and always God that is already in my tomorrow. Please go ahead and do now in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and pray your tomorrow is in his hand. It's already in your tomorrow. You know what he can do that will ensure your smooth passage into your tomorrow. He knows what he can do that will ensure your well-being your prosperity even now and always. Cry to him to do. Cry to him to do. Oh God that is already in my tomorrow. Whatever that you must do. Whatever that you have to do Lord. Oh that will guarantee. Yeah my well-being. My prosperity now and always. Father go ahead and do. Oh Lord go ahead and do. Oh Lord go ahead and do. Oh Lord go ahead and do. You are already in my tomorrow. Father go ahead and do Lord. Father go ahead and do Lord. Father go ahead and do Lord. Whatever that you have to do in my tomorrow Lord, that will guarantee my prosperity now, that will guarantee my well-being now and always. Father, do it now. Father, do it, O Lord. Father, do it, O Lord. Whatever you have to bring from tomorrow to today to guarantee my well-being now and always. Whatever you have to bring from tomorrow into today to guarantee my prosperity now and always. Father, go ahead and do. 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 Makato la to pasata la dalabo. Yelebo, jagada gaya gada bobo sheteli andra. Rada kolobo sutelebo shekeli hen lalabo. Father, go ahead and do, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus mighty name we pray amen you want to pray this prayer you want to command every mountain before you this year let the mountain be level now by thunder. Let the thunder of God strike to the ground every mountain before you this year. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Are you ready to pray somebody? Are you ready to pray somebody? Remember the scripture Jesus Christ said, you know, if you shall say to this mountain, to any mountain, be, let it be cast, you know, into the sea. He said, if you will not doubt your heart, you have whatever I say, command the mountain, let it be out of your way. Let no mountain be able to resist your upward movement. Let no mountain be able, to be able to resist your forward movement, even in the name of Jesus Christ. Say, every mountain before me this year. Aha. Can you say with all boldness, say, every mountain before me this year, I command in the name of Jesus, move out of my way, collapse by thunder. Move out of my way, collapse by thunder. In the name of Jesus, right? Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Whatever that want to stand as a mountain, command it out of your way this year. Whatever that is standing as a mountain, command it out of your way this year and let it collapse by the thunder of the Most High God. Every mountain before me this year, I command command you in the name of Jesus move out of my way collapse by thunder in the name of Jesus Christ every mountain on my path this year I command in the name of Jesus Christ move out of my path collapse by thunder in the name of Jesus Christ whatever that stands as a mountain on my path whatever that stands as a mountain on my way I had 
address you in the name of Jesus Christ. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Co collapse my thunder in the name of Jesus Christ. Marada suli alaba. Ibrada lo shagaba. Barodo zodo. Irudu gagaga. Iliku shaka. Imasura haladuda da. Irunduza. Monte. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Move out of my way. Move out of my path. Male koskada. Engrada loloza. Le korobo zagada gada ko. Jegeleva. Randa koza. Leka. Move out and kola. In the name of Jesus Christ. Move out and kola. In the name of Jesus Christ. Move out and kola. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus mighty name we pray amen you want to command that every door of blessing that you approach this year we open unto you on their own accord that every door of breakthrough you will approach this year we open unto you on their own accord in the name of jesus Christ. are you ready to pray somebody say every door of blessing can you say it with boldness? Say every door of blessing, every door of breakthrough that I shall approach this year, I command, open unto me on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ, open your mouth and pray that prayer. You will not be turned back at the oh, at the door of blessing. You will not be turned back at the door of breakthrough. Every door of blessing, every door of breakthrough that I shall approach this year, I command in the name of Jesus Christ. Open unto me on your own accord. Open unto me on your own accord. Open unto me on your own accord. Open unto me. Door of blessing, open unto me. Door of breakthrough, open unto me on your own accord. Every door of blessing that I shall approach this year, every door of breakthrough that I shall approach this year, I command in the name of Jesus Christ. Open unto me on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ. I will not be denied entry into blessing this year. I will not be denied entry into breakthrough this year. Every door of blessing open unto me on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every door of prosperity open unto me on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every door of breakthrough open unto me on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ. I will not be taught back at the door of blessing. I will not be refused at the door of breakthrough. Door of blessing in the name of Jesus. Open unto me on your own accord. Masuta la da sila duka ila du she tebru du zagada ila lula luba shaka. Every door of blessing I shall approach this year. Every door of blessing my wife, my children shall approach this year. Open unto us on your own accord in the name of Jesus. The door of breakthrough. The door of prosperity. I shall approve, my wife shall approve, my children shall approve. Open unto us on your own accord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Masatuli and the Kaske Lebrudusha. Irudu Zutalebu Shepale Debo Shekeli Anda. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. I want to agree with you now. You want to pray your own personal prayer. You want to make your request known unto Him. Shall you go ahead and begin to talk to God? Oh, for the next uh, one minute, go ahead and talk to him. Make your request known not only the year is still fresh. Tell him your desire, your expectation into this new year. Masatala bo shkala brodo shkala. Imbradali skali brodo shaka. Imbrodolo jagadaga yagada baba baba. Imbradada da do 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 jagadaga yagala bobo ja. Imbrodo zagadaga libo shekeliada. Imbradadu zakari alado ja. Irede lisoto bradali skada. Imbrodolo zadaga da kuli ala dushete iruba baba siara da silia da luja arada she ila duda makaka gaga ro urundozo elele 
Lele Juju Galagada, Gare Dolozi, Imbrodo Zagada Gayagada, Eliku Zakara Dobosata, Imbra Dalilis Kete Morondo Zende Lianda, Ingra Delizo Danuda, Angra Dalunzo Co, Bradalis Kede, Inglele Zodori and Dragaligo Lianda, Ele Gada Gada Gada, Irada Coco Zuzu, Irada Sota, Imbra Dalili Zekeli Odoboja, Amazurando Lolo Zelili Buruduza, Irodo Zucala da Shentele Rodobosata. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. I pray for you tonight in that name that is above every other name. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever God have to do in your yesterday to guarantee your well-being today and always, whatever God has to do in your yesterday to ensure your well-being and prosperity now and always, I ask, may the God that is still in your yesterday, go ahead and begin to do now in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever God has to do in your today to ensure your well-being and prosperity now and always. Whatever God have to do in your today, that God that is already in your today, I ask let him go ahead and begin to do now in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever God has to do in your tomorrow that will ensure hey, your wellness oh, and your prosperity, that will ensure your smooth movement from today to tomorrow, that will ensure your prosperous journey into tomorrow. I ask that God that is already in your tomorrow, let him go ahead and begin to do now in the name of Jesus Christ. Every error in your tomorrow, that every error in your yesterday, that is now affecting even your hell today, the God in your yesterday, correct that error now by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, whatever power that is delaying your joy, I break the hold of that power over your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever that stands as a mountain on your path this year, in the name of Jesus Christ, I command it to move out of your way and let it collapse by thunder. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I speak into your life every door of blessing, every door of opportunity, every door of breakthrough that you shall approach this year. Those doors shall open on their own accord to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will not be turned back at the door of blessing. You will not be refused at the door of breakthrough. In the name of Jesus Christ, surely as God live, this year shall be unto you, it shall be unto me. Our year of glorious manifestation in our ministry, in our health, in our finances, in our career, in our businesses, in all that has to do with us, is our year of glorious manifestation in the name of Jesus Christ. And there shall be performance by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. Thank you, our God, because you have answered. Thank you, the Most High. We bless your holy name forever. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Wow. Let somebody shout, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is done. Congratulations. Your seven days of waiting on him in place of prayer can never be in vain. You will see the full manifestations, the full impact of your prayers, even right from this moment, even in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, it's time to give our offering in this service, and I want to encourage you, this is the last day of the seven-day special programs. Amen. And so please, give God a worthy offering this evening, then you can also give him a thanksgiving seed, you know, thanking him in, you know, in anticipations of manifestation of answers to all your prayer. So aside your offering, you can also bring a thanksgiving offering unto him. Amen. Or you want to sow your seed. Maybe you have not sown the seed that I encourage to sow. Sow a seed for glorious man. It's our year of glorious manifestation. Sow a seed towards that. Amen. And expect it to manifest in the name of Jesus Christ. 
Lord. You want to release your tithe unto him? I want to pray for you. Or you want to give him your first offering, your first fruit offering? I want to pray for you. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, we cannot thank you at all for this day, for these seven days prayers. We cannot thank you for the impact the prayer is making already in our life, for the assurance, oh God, of our glorious manifestation this year by this prayer, oh Lord. Father, we say thank you in the name of Jesus Christ. Behold, your children that are proposed in their heart to release an offering unto you, oh God, or their seed, oh God, or seed, or, 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 or their thanksgiving offering. Oh God, for these seven days, Father, please receive this of them in the name of Jesus Christ. Behold, those that are giving unto you their tithes, or even their first fruit, Father, please receive this of them in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, my God, by our giving tonight, let a memorial continually be before you in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the answers to all our prayer in this seven day, let it manifest beyond our expectation in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive this we are giving tonight. Use it for the fortress of your work on earth and let us always have to give unto you even in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, faithful Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now there's an account detail that is showing on the screen. Please send in that your offering, that's your thanksgiving seed, or that your uh, uh, your tithe or your first fruit, whatever you want to give us, send it to that account. It's the hand of God that is stretched forth to receive of you. And surely it will respond back to you adequately, even in the name of Jesus Christ. Now I want to invite you to join me also. Tomorrow is Monday. It, we are resuming back our Monday's online service, amen, by 7 p.m. on this same channel, amen. So join me tomorrow by 7 p.m. and every Monday, amen, on this channel. Tomorrow we are still looking at battles against destiny. You can't afford not to be in this service, amen, by tomorrow by 7 p.m. on this same channel, battles against destiny destiny amen and i want to encourage you if you are yet to subscribe to this our channel please press the subscription button amen press subscribe amen press the subscription button you know i look forward to see you subscribe amen so that you can always be on whenever we are on on this channel even in the name of Jesus Christ. And for those that are in Abuja and in Environ, remember this coming Saturday, the 13th day of January, we'll be having, you know, the first prayer bombardment on the mountain and it's going to be a special anointing service. Amen. Come and receive the empowerment, the anointing for the new year. You can't afford not to be present in this special anointing service the 13th day, the Saturday on the mountain at Gusapi in Abuja and time is going to be 7 a.m. I look forward to see you there even in the name of Jesus Christ. Can we share the grace now in fellowship? May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Lift up your right hand. Say, I am God's fire on the move. Say, I am God's fire on the move. I am God's fire on the move. At my appearance, darkness must disappear. I am God's fire on the move. Whatever that cannot stop God will not be able to stop me. I am God's fire on the move. Amen. One powerful hallelujah to the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. God bless you. Happy New Year to you once again. Till I come your way tomorrow, remain blessed.